Welcome to First Man Satellite World. Look at this decoder. This is Redline T50 Combo Hef decoder. Redline T50 Combo decoder. Look at it. Yeah. I'm opening the box for you to see. This is how the inside uh, looks like. This is Redline T50 Combo decoder. You see? Yes, this is the decoder inside. Red light T50. You can see the back. The back is like this. And you see the front like this. This is red line T50. Combo decoder. Have decoder. I'm coming to put power in for you to know, to see the problem with this decoder. What is wrong dec with this decoder? Welcome to First Man Satellite. Once again. I've put power in. And look at this. Look, look at the decoder. It will remain like this. You see, boot on. But it will not boot completely. It will remain on like this. It won't come. So today too, I want to teach you how to solve a booting problem of Redline T50 Combo Have Decoder. Redline T50 Combo Have Decoder. How to solve a booting problem of a Redline T50 Redline T50 Combo Have Decoder. You see? It still remains like this. So, in case you have a problem like this with your Redline T50, you just download the decoder software and you rename the decoder software recovery.bin. You rename it recovery.bin. Please, when renaming it, don't delete the file extension.bin. You just have to uh, write recovery and add it to the .bin. So, after renaming it, you put it on empty USB flash drive. You put the software on empty USB flash drive. And then, uh, you insert it uh, in the USB port of the decoder. You see, the USB port is at the back place like this, as you can see, yes. So, you insert it in any of, any of it. So I'm coming to do exactly that now. So, so like this, you put the decoder off first before you put your USB, you have renamed the decoder software recovery.bin in the decoder. So I'm coming to put it off and insert my USB drive, flash drive. Now you can see, yes, I have inserted my uh, USB flash drive at the back of the decoder as you can see yes my software is already renamed recovery.bin so I'm coming to put power in turn it on and let's see what will happen now I've put power in let's see you see boot look at it let's see what will happen look at it you see yes it is upgrading it is upgrading if you, if you look, it is on boot, but it's upgrading. This is how, you see, are you sure you want to upgrade recovery dot? This is how uh, this decoder uh, behaves when upgrading. Yes. So like this, the upgrade is done. Like this, the upgrade is done. So I'm coming to plug out. I'm coming to plug out the USB. I'm coming to put it off and remove the USB. Then turn it on again and see what uh, will happen. Whether it will now boot successfully or not. Welcome to First Man Satellite. Please subscribe and share.
so you can see i've turned it off i've turned it off and i have to remove my usb flash drive you see yeah now i'm turning it on again to see whether it will boot successfully or not i put power in let's see you can see here now boot let's see whether it will boot successful or not welcome to first man satellite and you see the tv screen you see cut it yes this is how to recover redline t50 combo have when it is not booting completely this is how you can see now it reads zero zero you see everything is now working fine you see no problem with it welcome to first man satellite please subscribe and share my channel